how many times have you seen some news crew standing out in the cold just to tell you how cold it is? You know it's cold. We know it's cold. So when our boss told us to cover the weather, we said enough with it and did it our way. Just because you're cold doesn't mean we have to be. Cold question mark? Call us. Be on TV! Exclamation point. The plan was hatched. Now, we just had to get someone to stop in the cold to talk to us. I don't know. There's no one outside. It's so cold. <laughs> it took some convincing. But before long... Hello? Hi, Hi, what's your name? John stopped to chatter with us. I couldn't even get off my motorcycle because my knees were basically frozen. As we moved from window to window. It's so cold, my, uh, my, my tights are actually frozen to my legs. We were reminded through frozen phones how lucky we were. We're doing a cold weather story, and our goal is to do the entire story without ever having to leave the building. Got it. You're a smart Everyone compared Seattle's weather to cold they'd experienced before. Well, I've had a weather like this up in Anchorage. How bad is it out there? It's Michigan cold. Each time, it was worse here. Washington State or Washington, D.C.? Um, according to an informal Facebook poll this morning, it is Washington State for sure. <laughs> <laughs> but you can be sure that every phone call ended with a smile. Excellent. Thank you so much for stopping and talking to us. Because for once, it was a warm reporter watching viewers out in the cold and not the other way around. We are going to go in and get some hot chocolate, and then we're going to go home and get under the cover. Just stay there. Inside at Como. It's so cold. Lindsay Cohen, Como 4 News.